this is the process for calibrating the machine to use meter depositing accurately. For this process to work, we need to check on a couple of things. One, the machine needs to be in temper or in the condition that we want to use the meter chocolate. So if we're using a depositing head, the depositing head will be on it. In this case, we're not using a depositing head, so all we need to make sure is that the chocolate is in temper. The other condition, we need to put it into the meter depositing mode. To do that, we're going to press this button until the light illuminates. At that point, we get a series of weights that are programmed into the machine. These are all changeable by pressing and holding that illuminated button until it blinks and changing. So in this case, from 400 grams to 420 grams. However, that does still not mean the battery will actually be 100 to 420 grams until we calibrate the machine. To calibrate the machine, we need a couple of things. We need a scale that measures in metric. We need a bowl. And again, we need our machine to put chocolate in temper. So to get to the calibration mode, we come from the meter depositing mode, we press and hold both of these buttons. The machine will beep, and we'll change, this screen will change to P5. We're gonna change that to P1. You can now see that this says 69. In this case, it would be 69 grams. The machine believes that this deposit is 69 grams, but we have to actually measure that. Hold on the scale, we tear our scale, and we catch a deposit. The scale reads 58. So I change this number to be 58. At that point, we change this screen to say P5. This now says 414 for our machine. But let's find out what it really is. Again, I tear my scale. And I'm going to catch a deposit. In this case, it reached 334. So I change this to say 334. At this point, to get out of the calibration mode, from P5, we press both of these buttons at once quickly, and you can see that we've returned to our normal temperature setting on the right, and we've returned to a weight on the left. At this point, all of these settings should be accurate, but let's double check. Again, I tear my scale. This should be a 150 gram deposit, and it's reading 150. And that's how we calibrate the machine.